By the way, speaking of racism, <clears throat> yes. and this is something, it's not quite, uh, this, but it's one of my favorite stories. And every mm. once in a while, I find one of my favorite stories, and then I get really angry later in the day because Drudge posts it before we can do it. Mm. And that's what happened with this one, but it's still worth doing. As a rising star in Hungary's far-right Jobbik party, Sanad Zegnegi, I'm guessing at that point. Not from the Zegnegi family, is he? <laughs> so so the Zegnegi family. Hungarian yeah. Zegnegis? Yeah, the Zegnegi oh, family. They're big. <laughs> was notorious for his incendiary comments on Jews. Oh, boy. He accused them of buying up the country, railed about the Jewishness of the political elite, and claimed Jews were desecrating national symbols. Then came a revelation that knocked him off his perch as ultra-nationalist standard bearer. Zygnegi himself is was a Jew. Mm -hmm. Oh, no. Following weeks of internet rumors, <laughs> Zygnegi, and I guess it's not even close to how you pronounce that name, acknowledged in June that his grandparents on his mother's side, his mother's side were Jews, making him one, two under Jewish law, even though he doesn't practice the faith. His grandmother was an Auschwitz survivor, and his grandfather, a veteran of forced labor camps. Wow. Mm. At the root of the drama is also an audio tape of a 2010 meeting between Zegnegi and a convicted felon. Zegnegi acknowledges that the meeting took place, but contends the tape was altered in unspecified ways. In the recording, the felon is heard confronting Zegnegi with uh, evidence of his Jewish roots. So he says to the guy, dude, you're Jewish. He sounds surprised. Then he offers money and favors in exchange for keeping quiet. He's bribing people to tell so that he won't be revealed as being Jewish. That's great. Under pressure, he resigned last month from all party positions and gave up his membership in the party. That wasn't good enough for the party. Last week, uh, it asked him to give up his seat in the parliament. And uh, Wait, because he's Jewish? Because he's Jewish. You can't be Jewish in the Hungarian parliament? No, well, you can't be Jewish if you're in this party in the Hungarian parliament because their whole platform is, we don't like Jews. <laughs> wow. 